So basically, there's a new theory going around. Basically. By the way, this guy's really good. He um he's on TikTok, and I I love his content. He goes to like Trump rallies, and plays it real straight, and asks them questions. And these people are just goblins. I feel bad in a way because these are good. These, these seem like nice people, and they're. It's just sad that they get caught up in this cult. But is he like not to start drama? But is he biting Andrew a little bit? Oh, this guy's been around for a while. Okay. No, no, it's a diff. The whole vibe is totally different. Trump plus JFK Jr. is what his shirt says. That man is red oh, yeah. boy. Hell Biden yeah. is not alive right now. No, the guy that's doing the stand-up job of trying to wake people up is an actor wearing a mask. I mean, there's several different people playing Joe Biden at this point. And the, when, <sighs> when he fell up the stairs going on the airplane, I myself think that that was Jim Carrey. I've heard that he was one of them. I <laughs> wait, 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 wait. You think that Jim Carrey was wearing a mask and was the acting president silly and being silly by falling up the stairs three different times and james woods also shtick. i think is one of the doppelganger mask wearing people you think by wow actually i saw that jim carrey responded to that that yes. was jim oh, carrey oh dear <laughs> so this is the guy J jason uh selvig mm. the good liars that's how i want to promote them the good liars on TikTok is where I consume their content. They're really good. Actually, here, I'll What's the most you important one. issue in the governor's race here in Virginia? Getting back to the basics of teaching children, not teaching them critical race theory. And, uh, and, and what is critical race theory? Well, I'm not going to get into the specifics of it because I don't understand it that much. But it's something that I don't. Oh boy. The, what little bit that I know, I don't care for. And and what have you heard that you, that you don't? Well, that you I'm, don't not, like? I'm, I'm not going to. You know, I, I don't. Uh, I was in foot him. Uh, That's so interesting. I don't. I don't have yeah. that much knowledge on it. But okay. it's something. But that I know what. But I know like I it. hate it. I know I hate it. I know what I hate, and I know what I like. <laughs> and I hate that critical race theory. Yeah, so he does a lot of stuff like this. It's really good. Um, kind of depressing. <sighs> kind of sad. But... I sent his TikTok, if that's easier. Oh, yeah. Let me, yeah, actually, let's look at some. I really like his content. I'm giving him a little promo here. He's doing good work. He's doing God's work. The Good Liars on TikTok. It sounds like you were just turned away from the... Here, I'll, look, I'll just look you at the... You think really Biden is not alive right now? No, the, the guy Just saw that. My name is Ralph Rebant, and I'm running for the governor of Michigan. I'm a pastor, but I'm running, I'm bringing God back into culture because I'm convinced that if we don't get God right in this next election, nothing will matter. Bringing God back to Michigan, <laughs> um, what would that look like? Would there be religion taught in schools? Uh, there would be, uh, as our founder said, the Bible should be the basic textbook in scripture, I mean in schools. Are there books that you don't want to see in schools? Uh, I would remove the pornography. So we need to ban, we need to ban books that, that have porn, pornographic imagery in them, right? Yes, yes. Because, because we, somebody was telling us about a book that had like two daughters getting their dad drunk and having sex with them. Yeah, I knew you were going that way. I knew you were doing that. Yeah, that's a good point. So you're saying ban the Bible in school. Uh, no, I'm not saying ban the Bible in school. I, I get where you're going with your questions. It's, it's a, you, you're saying anything that has a pornographic image should be banned, and the, there are some images in the Bible about you know, sex and incest and things like that. So it sounds like you're saying we should ban the Bible. Uh, what I am saying is that the Judeo-Christian principles under which our country is founded need to be brought back into culture. And I, that, I can't state it any more clearly than that. Um, if when, that means banning the Bible, so be it. <laughs> the Bible would not be banned from culture or... From the schools. I'm just saying the schools. Protect the kids. <laughs> no, I... My name is Ralph Listen. Lund, I'm running for the governor of Michigan. Yeah, because the, these pastor. people are going on like a mad tear banning yeah. books. You know, don't say gay. It's having, it's like a deep culture war issue now. And it's like any book that depicts anything uh, educational about sex or uh, sexuality of any kind is like, ban, fuck, ban. Well, it's like, yeah, it's a great point, you know? 
Hey, I'm here outside of Planned Parenthood on a Saturday morning where a bunch of anti-abortion protesters have signs and are trying to stop people from getting abortions. I'm going to go join them. <laughs> okay. What's that? <laughs> no, 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 no. The traffic, the people ruining the protest. <laughs> no, 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 no. You guys do whatever you want. <laughs> Are you guys headed out? Yes. It's unfortunate that this one sign can ruin a protest. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, well, now it's just me. <laughs> That's true. That That's is kind good. of impressive. Yeah, these guys are great. I'm telling you, they're they're hard working too. Yeah. They're, Who would you rather have look at president? This shit's on uh, Joe Biden or Vladimir Putin? Oh, Putin. Definitely. And and why and why is that? Um, I believe he's been given a tough. Uh, since since World War II, uh, Russia's been the bad guy. When in actuality, the Nazis left Germany, and they ended up going to the Ukraine, coming in here. George Bush was was actually, thank you. George Bush was actually a Nazi. Who would you rather? <laughs> well, that's, that that based, might be true. Actually, based. Yeah, that based. Was... That's a base take, actually. <laughs> but like. I mean, this is the this is the conserv. There's like a fringe conservative <laughs> movement that is pro Putin, and I think I just find it really funny when you have Elon Musk tweeting out these memes about the left moving, and it's like here you have someone literally saying, "I wish Putin was the president, and not Biden." Vladimir Putin. That's true. But there you go. The good liars went on a tangent there. Uh, <laughs>